Hey everyone, Asaprin here, Coming 101. Um, you gotta check out this video. This is gonna be really cool. I didn't not mean to come across this, but I did. I found it at Walmart, so I don't know too much information about it. It's just, I guess they took me off guard. I don't know if this is a Walmart exclusive or whatnot, but I'm glad I found it. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna, anything that's related to this video will be a, more of a reviews underneath this one. So we got more to check it out. We're going to put the original review of the 2012 um, Shell Razor one underneath this one. And, and of course, fighter corners and all the good stuff to go toy hunting in California and Colorado. So uh, whew, I hope you enjoyed this review, people. So today at Walmart, I found a Hell Razor or <laughs> Shell Razor. And I noticed, wait a minute. It's different. It's green. Totally different. Bottom piece is what they have on the bottom. Of course, the regular shell, shell razor. Or the party van, sorry. Dang, it's been a long day. This one has 2016. I think it looks pretty sweet like this color. So now I got two of them, the regular one and this version. So who knows if we're gonna make some new ones or not. So we're gonna open this up and see what we could do. Wow, it looks amazing like this. Uh, it looks like they actually put the stickers on the back. Whoa, then I got my pieces on. Yeah, they put the stickers on the back. Thank you. Thank you. And that was the part I couldn't put together right because it keeps on evening. So they have this thing, so the door won't slide open. This was on the bottom piece. I wasn't sure if it was supposed to be like that or whatnot, but there's all the tools. The wheels looks pretty sweet. And of course, the stickers. All right, <coughs> we added the gun. Got the little missiles inside, Let's see. Of course you push this button to shoot. This button right here goes out. I gotta attach this thing. Attach this bad boy. Attach the back part. And these guys right here. Goes to the side, as you can see how it looks like right there. Attach it right there. Alright, check this out. The back piece right here says right. Correct? See so how the gun. So therefore. This side is right. Well, I was trying to attach this thing and it wouldn't go in at all. I mean, it didn't even look like it goes in at, to the spot. So when you look underneath this thing, it will tell you L for left and right. Well, according to this one, what says right. I put the right, it didn't even, like I said, it didn't even bother to fit in right. Perf not even perfect. Put the left one in, and well, it looks a lot better. And it's attached. And see how it looks like it goes straight? When you put the right in, it didn't look right for some strange reason seeing I put the other one in but it fits perfectly in there like so I don't know if that was a blooper or or whatnot but yeah so this is number one <clears throat> number two number three the very top these were not easy to put in I have a tweezers to put them in for me so Jesus Here's four and five. <clears throat> I know they're not in right, and I don't care because you gotta have a lot of patience to put these little small stickers in, and I don't. Especially I have fat fingers, so this isn't easy for some people. <sighs> I don't know what number I'm on. So you gotta put danger in the back part. Gotta put that in the front. This on top right there. And the one I hated the most was this little thing right here. Yeah, there you go. Another spot to put these ones. Oh my god, pain in my butt, I swear. I'm trying to even them out, but we know that won't happen. Now, I don't know what the instructions trying to tell me because it says something totally different. Probably got these all wrong. Pretty sure that was supposed to be right here and it's supposed to be right there or. Maybe that's supposed to be over there. I don't know. I'll just put them right there because it fits. Then, stick it on the back. That's exactly how they say. 
more, and then I had to put this one in the back. Brake lights, which is kind of a pain in my butt. Out of that, out of that, that right there. And the one that was really easy to do was right there. Turn this off right now. Yeah. Here's one side right here. I kind of didn't even it out on top, but one, two, three, four, and the bottom right there. So there goes that one right there, people. <clears throat> Coming out pretty cool. Now on the other side, that's what it looks like right here. For some reason why these don't really fit on this, but that's what they said to do, so I did it. And this right here, this is where the door opens. Wash your shell. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Now we have the big wheels and you get the little wheels. So if you guys try to get this toy without the wheels, <clears throat> make sure there's two different sizes. Remember, two little wheels and two, two big wheels. And then that's where these guys come in right there. It goes straight in the middle, attaching to the pieces right here. Alright, so remember, the big wheels goes in the back, little wheels in the front. And they go on pretty easy, so this is good snap snap, there you go. There you go. Add it on. Stickers, like I showed you, that, you know, you can tell this one goes to the big one, you know, the little sticker goes to the little one. So, this is awesome. I think it looks a lot better like this color. I mean, I like this green thing going on here. I don't know what do you guys think. Do you like the green one better or do you like the very first brown gold rest look to it? But I like it. I like the stickers better on this one too. It looks so much cooler. Ah, oh, just amazing. So don't forget, you got that front door. Just in case you never own one, you have a trap door right there. Fits inside nicely. All these. You could actually put like. Maybe like eight characters in there because I know I did it. Go on there. Of course, this one on top opens up. If it lets me, there you go. They come up here, hold on to the you know the missile and shoot. And then this one, it's awesome. I have to show you this one. All right, so we're gonna use this Leo. I believe you go like this. No, nope. maybe not. Supposed to make a click 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 noise. <laughs> they usually do that click, 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 like the original. So, I guess they fixed it. Maybe. Put this in. There you go. Close the door. Rat him along. A foot soldier comes out, push his button, and me out. <laughs> okay. I think we had to fix his legs. I guess we'll just bend him backwards. Guess not. Let's go on with this. Let's find out. Or supposedly. Okay. Oh, he's not cooperating right with this Leo. Is it really that difficult for you? There it goes. Alright, for certain turtles, obviously you gotta push his legs back because it doesn't go all the way. Okay. Oh, no, don't you dare. There is that clicking noise. I was like, what happened to that noise? Okay. Take three. No way because of the door. There it goes. 
So it's not the door. I thought it was a maybe, like, maybe the door is wrong. But no, I gotta make sure he's actually in differently. Alright. <clears throat> so there you go, guys. Oh, one more thing. One more thing. Alright, Leo, you can let go now. Let go, Leo. Let go. Okay, good. Forgot one more thing. Um, can't even see that. Look, it even says 2012 Viacon. It doesn't say made in California like the other one does. It actually says Hong Kong. Uh, the original toys of 2012, they all had that print made in California, which is like right across the street from, um, what do they call themselves? The LAX airport. Really close. And now that all the new ones and the remake ones are all say said Hong Kong. So I don't know why I didn't change it to 2016 because he changed the Hong Kong thing. But either way, I like this. So the final test, what I'm really, 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 really curious about. Really, really curious about. And I'm about to show you. That's right. I want to put in a black light. So let's see how this beautiful green color looks. Bam. Look at that. Look how cool that looks. Holy crap. Even that thing's glowing. Whoa. That is amazing. And the front. Wow. And the side, oh, dude, that's beautiful. Look at that. Perfect. This is so made for a black light. Even though, even the back looks pretty cool. Look at that. Ah, you know me and my black light. I love neon colors because of this. Even though that looks like a 3D effect right there. Look how cool that looks. Amazing, people. Seriously. Alrighty, it looks like I'm going to take some black light pictures. I haven't done that for a while, but awesome, guys. So, this has to be a, definitely a go. I mean, you, I know you guys had the 2012 thing going on, the original, but I have to say this one is super cool. The colors look fantastic. The stickers look so much better. And not only that, it glows perfectly in your black light collection, guys. So, if you're like me who, with the black light stuff, this is definitely a go. I'm kind of curious about this guy, too. Uh, the white on his leg glows, but check out the shell. Hey, <laughs> glows. Cool. All right, guys. Share this video with with me. Share it. Show your friends. Seriously, I know. I did not hear any news about this shell razor being remake or anything like that. But I'm glad I found it by accident. I didn't. Like I said, I was not expecting this. So put your comments down, people. Tell me what do you think. You like this better than the original, or you like the original better than this? Um, yeah. Share this. Like this video if it, if I helped you out on your um. I would put things together really. And um, if you don't like it, there's something seriously wrong here. But seriously, this is sweet, like unbelievable sweet. All right, guys. That's my little review. I hope you enjoy it. I hope they come out with another one. I seriously do hope there's a different version coming out.